Remember when Hallcraft Beads uh, had a going out of business sale? Well, I went crazy. Um, hi guys, welcome to our channel and uh, we're going to do a haul video today going over the stuff that I got from Hallcraft. Um, this was a while back, but I hadn't had a chance to use any of these beads yet, so we'll go through stuff that I got from there. Okay, let's get started. Okay, first thing I got is this um, turquoise bead. This is how light dyed um, turquoise color. This is in size 4mm. And um, this is like a bunch of three, uh, strand, uh, three, um, uh, two bead strands. Um, so you can never have enough turquoise colored beads. So I had to get that one. Let's see if I have any more turquoise. No. Okay. The next thing I got is this fire polish. This is again another um, three bunch beads, two strands. Uh, really nice uh, muted tone color. Uh, another I thing I got is this pink sparkly iridescent beads again in three bunches um, This one is uh, brushed gold uh, Bicone beads um, This is good to uh, use it as a spacer bead or even if you make like bracelet just with these beads. It look really nice um, as a stacker bead uh, stacker bracelets um, another gold toned uh, beads. This one's a sparkly one. 72 pieces. Um, I'm excited about this one. I don't know how I'm going to use it yet, but it's a nice lilac color. Um, this is Preciosa beads. There's this one, and I got it in this color as well. Nice jewel tone and different sizes. This is, um, let's see, 8 mm, 6 mm, and 4 mm sizes. So can't wait to play with these and then next I got Millie Fury beads 6mm again the bunches if you can see this okay and we got pearls freshwater pearls uh, one can never have enough of freshwater pearls so every time I go shopping I always uh, have to get pearls and then I got three bunches of these beads as well um, nice lavender lavender color um they're calling this amethyst check glass lentil beads so i think i'm gonna make some earrings with these very nice and then some clear iridescent or ab uh, drop beads these are also i think um, basic beads where you can use for anything um this is impression jasper um what it looks like it's a sapphire impression jasper beads so i don't have any plans for this yet we'll see what we come up with uh more of the uh, brushed gold bicone beads like i said I, I really like these beads they're um very useful in um, different kinds of projects and i got more of those and um nice red deep red um Ronde are these rondelles? No, they're not rondelles. They're round beads. Um, what size are they? 4 mm's. And then next we have, uh, again, three bunch again here, three bunches. Um, this is a shell beads. I think they're called uh, rice shaped. What are they called? Uh, tube. They're calling it tube beads. Um, very beautiful. And then more pearls. Uh, these are lavender potato pearls. And then nice blue glass beads, 4 mm's. And then I, oh, one more. One more glass tube beads. Again, basic black beads that you can use it on anything. And then I got some um, findings and wires. First we got, oh, they had these bundles where there's um, there's a nylon cord with some um, clasps and I don't know, uh, some jump rings. And I don't know what these, these things are called. Um, uh, they're like a crimp. Some kind of a crimper for your bracelet so 
Uh, we'll have to learn how to use this. Oh, and then a needle, a very flexible needle. Okay, so this is going to be very useful. Um, some chains. And there's two of them here. Oh no, I opened this one already. I think there was three and then I opened one. Well, let me show you since this one's already open. And this is a bracelet chain. We can add charms to this or we can just pretty much wear it like this as a stacking bracelet. This is gold plated. Um, so it'll, it will, it can last for a while if you take good care of it. And then we have some uh, neck, uh, necklace, chain necklace, um, 16 inch. Well, let's open this up and show you guys. Oh, this is kind of stiff for me because... Come on. Okay, there we are. Okay, so chain with a clasp already attached. Um, so maybe we can add like a little pendant on this and it'll look really cute in cute instant jewelry here. So there's your chain and then oh one more. We forgot this little guy here. Um this is Mother of Pearl beads in size, is it 4mm, 3mm, doesn't say it there, but Mother of Pearl beads there, uh, light blush pink, and um, the last thing we have here are the Memory Wire uh, Gold Tone. I use these a lot in jewelry making, they're very easy to work with um, and makes pretty much instant jewelry, so someday uh, we'll work on this together and show you guys what I make. Um, that's pretty much what I have for this haul. Thank you for joining me. Uh, please subscribe to our channel so that we can share more of um, things like these. And uh, we'll see you on the next video. Bye.